This call is now being recorded. So settle down. And forgetting everything first. We'll have the awareness of ourselves and we'll disconnect ourselves from the world to get into the practice for the highest benefit. So stop moving and sit the way you feel comfortable with the hands at rest on the legs, chin slightly down, eyes open. Forgetting the world, try to concentrate over the presence of your own body first. Feel head neck. Right left hand. Front back part of the trunk. Right leg, left leg. And make up your mind for the prayer. linear stretch, stand up back, and then we will have the poses of the Pavan Muktasana sequence. These are all though termed as the preparatory practice, but it actually covers 60% of human body, mind, and soul aspect. And this also is to some extent neglected by the society in considering its importance. We'll not do that. We'll take into account its value and we will prepare ourselves well. So stand up first. Put closer. <clears throat> so he's touching each other, hands ahead. 
body first use. Then with inhalation, raise both hands upward. Stretch hand up more and more. Keep legs stressed and fix your gaze towards some object in front. Whenever you do the poses, it should start from the comfort and then we should build on that comfort by extending or involve the body more and more. With the gaze fixed on some point, keep all the fingers close. Simply see the body inhaling and exhaling. No extra effort right now is needed on the breath, but attention is required. 10 seconds more. Legs also must be stressed with more and more extension around the back of the knees. And once you feel the involvement of the thigh muscles and the calf muscle. Now, a conscious inhalation, hold it for some seconds, three, four seconds time. And while exhaling hands down, Relax hands and get comfortable. Um, a foot gap between the legs. One more preparatory practice. Sideways bending, upright in. Hold breath, raise right hand up from the side, drop body leftward. Hands stretched away, head neck down. Breath is running, we can have attention over it. Now, hold one exhalation. Inhalation center, exhalation, hands down, shoulders loose, other side, inhalation, raise hand up, drop body right over. Stretch hand away, head neck down, conscious breathing, Slater. Exhibition of hands or body rules. That's the one. Now, uh, Sushma, asanas, lie down on the ground. First one is Pada Uttana Asana, where we will raise leg up, club with inhalation and exhalation. Put closer, hand by the side of the body. First, a breath out. With inhalation, right leg raised up. Hold it for three, four seconds. Inhalation down. Inhalation up. Hold it for the seven seconds time. Eight. 
exhalation down. Inhalation, rightly up. Hold it for 10 seconds time. A holding inhalation and the raised leg. Exhalation down. It just looks a bit. It just hit me lower back a bit. Now we'll go towards the other side. Inhalation, left leg up. Hold it for three, four seconds time. Exhalation down. Inhalation up. For seven seconds time. Exhalation down. For 10 seconds, raise left leg up with inhalation. Hold it. Exhalation down. Let's close them up. It just hit them a bit. Now with both legs. First, exhale. Inhalation. Raise both legs up and hold it for three, four seconds. Exhalation down. For seven seconds, inhalation, raise both legs up. Hold inhalation and the pose for the seven seconds time. Exhalation down. One more time, 10 seconds time. <clears throat> Raise both legs up with inhalation. Hold inhalation and the raised leg. Get ready. Inhale. Come up. Exhalation down. Split legs. Let's for some seconds time. Now, the second position, this is the Pada Chakrasana, where we will open up the thigh joint and we will strengthen the hip muscle to take up poses properly. Get ready for that position, keep foot closer. Hand close with the body. Body loose first. Now hands spread towards the side. With inhalation, raise right leg up. Now rotate right leg in the clockwise direction. Inhalation, upward movement, exhalation, downward movement, 10 times. Get ready. One, two, three, four, five, Six, seven, eight, <clears throat> nine, 
9 and 10. Top the right leg, the head chest, both the legs a bit, head neck a bit. And now we'll go towards the other side before we take the rotation in anti clockwise direction. Get ready. Inhalation, raise left leg up. Now, the rule will remain the same. Whenever coming down, exhalation. Whenever going up, inhalation. So, 10 times. One. Clockwise direction. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Let's lose them up. Other direction. Means in the anti clockwise direction, raise right leg up again with the inhalation. As you rotate it clockwise, now the anti clockwise means the right leg going far. One, now two. Three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Just like a bit, head neck a bit, rest a while. Now we we'll go towards the other side. Get ready. Raise left leg up. The anti club restriction, going far on exhalation, down, inhalation, up. Get ready. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, nine, and ten. Adjust legs, take hands back, body rules. So after the Padapada Asan and the Padasan Chalan Asan, Padajakrasan, now the Pada Sanchalan Asan. Legs will remain close. Hand wide spread, or you can even cut down it spread a bit. Keep palm around a foot to feet in half away from the body. Then fold both legs up. Move them or uh, left foot up to take the leg close towards the abdomen. Get ready. 
one by one with both legs. We just have to do the sanchalan or the movements. And then we will do the reverse also. If there be confusion connecting the thread, you can do the movements slowly. There is no rush while doing these practices. We are keeping ourselves in the environment of the practice and the environment itself will build the body and the mind. So get ready. Inhalation, leg going away. Exhalation, coming down. Reverse. The different ways of doing the same practice. Sometimes just with one breath in, we can do the rotation a couple of times, and then while exhaling, we can get the legs back. This, I think, is easy in the beginning. Let's go with this rule. Take a breath in and hold it. And then the Sanchalan or the movements of the leg holding inhalation 10 times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten, exhale. Keep foot on the ground. Let's just lower back a bit. Rest for some seconds before we go for the reverse direction. The rule will remain the same. We'll inhale, we'll allow the movement, and then while exhaling, we will release it. If there is breath leak, is no problem. You can redo the things as per the rule. Ready, breath in, hold it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine and ten. Exhale, top foot. So legs at ease for some time. Just for a minute before we go further. Even rest in the second position if you feel it more convenient. 30 seconds more. The next two poses is the problem of tasking and the rocking and the rolling, preparing our back. Literally, for the Pavan Muktasan and the Jhulan Karshanasan, called as rock, rocking and rolling. Lie down again on the back. And close the body. Hold right leg up. Keep foot on the ground. Then move right leg towards the abdomen. 
catch hold of the right leg with the left palm. While exhaling, put pressure on the leg to move it towards the abdomen. Elbows towards the side. With inhalation, come up. Hold it for the count of five. One, two, three, four, five. Exhalation, head down. Lose grip a bit. One time more. Get ready. Exhalation, cut down the gap between the leg and the abdomen. The other side. Now for the count of 10. Inhale, hold the inhalation and the pose. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, Slowly get down on exhalation. Lose grip a bit. One more part left. On the count of five again. On exhalation, cut down the gap between the leg and the abdomen, elbows to the side. Nation, come up. Hold inhalation on the pose. One, two, three, four, five. <laughs> on exhalation. Hands then. Slowly by the side of the body, right foot on the ground. Take a breath in. While exhaling, open up the right leg. Hold left leg up. And just back a bit. Move left leg towards the abdomen. Right foot squared in. Catch hold of the left leg with the locked palm. Exhalation, inward pressure, then inhale, hold it for the count of five. Hold the breath and the pose, get ready. Exhalation to cut on the gap between the left leg and abdomen. Inhalation, come up. One. Two, three, four, five. Slowly exhale. Lose grip a bit. Inhale. Exhale, inhale again, exhalation, cut down the gap between the leg and the abdomen, inhalation, come up, count of 10, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. On exhibition, head down. 
Lose grip a bit. One last section left. On the count of five. Get ready. On exhalation, I'll take the left leg close towards the abdomen, elbow side. Inhalation, come up. Hold it. One, two, three, four, five. Exhalation. Palm on the ground, foot on the ground, take a breath in. Exhalation, open up the left leg. Hands spread wide, body use. Next position, rolling. Hold both legs. Just back a bit. Move the words of abdomen and catch hold of the leg from under the leg. Keep the palm close with the back of the knee. Then inhalation come up. Exhalation go down. Inhalation. Exhalation down. Inhalation up. 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 Exhalation down. Inhalation up, exhalation down, inhalation up, exhalation down, inhalation up, hold inhalation for the count of five. One, two, three, four, five. Exhalation, go back. Inhalation come up, count to five, one, two, three, four, five. Exhalation, go back. Inhalation come up, hold it, count to five. One, two, three, four, five. Exhalation. A couple of times. Rolling. With a natural breath happening. Forty times. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 
Hands back, what I lose. Next position is Supta Udar Karshanasan, working highly for abdominal reason. Lie down again. Sit in between, you feel difficulty. Cut down your effort, you can take rest. And again, after you are restored, you can rejoin. Put closer. Hands spread wide. Head neck loose. Take a breath in. Hold it and move it towards the abdomen. Keep knee and foot closer while exhaling. Drop both legs towards the right side. Neck left forward. All the five breath. One. Two. Three. Four, five, four exhalation, inhalation center, head and the legs, exhalation other side, move head rightward, knee and foot closer for the five breath. One, two, three, four, five. Inhalation, center. Exhalation, drop foot on the ground. Just back a bit, head neck a bit, rest for some time. Now, stand up. I don't know some salutation before we go further. Put closer. Body loose. Humbly join the palm. Raise hands upward. Coming down then. Move head inward and take the right leg back. Show the right knee. Look up. Drop head. Left right knee. Take the left leg back. Foot closer. Take head more inward. Breath here a couple of times. Then knee, chest, chin, more close to the ground. While inhalation, look up. 
exhalation or asan or exhalation take the left leg ahead right knee close with the ground inhalation look up or exhalation drop head take both legs ahead while exhaling move head inward towards the legs Inhalation, with hands upward, go back, exhalation, join palm, loose up the legs, turn more pose, get ready, inhale, hands up, <coughs> Exhale, hands down. Hold exhalation, take left in front. Left knee close to the ground. Inhale, look up. Hold exhalation, drop head, take both legs back. While it's touching full, exhale. Like this. That's up. Okay, a couple of times. Then take knee, chest, chin, with the ground. Inhalation, look up. Exhalation, head inward. Hold exhalation, take right leg ahead. Left knee close towards the ground. Inhale, look up. Holding inhalation, drop head, take both legs ahead. Exhaling, move head inward towards your legs. Inhalation, head hands up. Go back. Exhalation, join palm. Again, sit down. Sit with the legs open, shoulders loose at ease, hands come tucked in, then close them at least. Both hands ahead, around the knees, back straight, foot squared in, legs partly stressed. Body comfortable. Next pose, Raju Karshanasan. Inhale, raise right hand up. Stretch right hand, drop head to look towards the right palm. Hold inhalation and pose for the count of five. One, two, Three, four, five, exhale. Other side. Get ready. Inhale, raise left hand up. Stretch hand upward, drop head. Hold inhalation for the count of five. One, two, 
Now with both hands, get ready. Inhale both hands up. Hold inhalation, stretch hand up, drop head neck to look towards door. Please count of five. One, two, three, four, five. Exhale. Take hands back, chop head neck. What do you use? Next position, the camp of Meru Krasan, where we will twist the spine to look backward, have gap between the legs, one and a half feet to two feet, adjust muscles. Body comfortable. First, come ahead to grab your toes comfortably. <laughs> Take the can backward. Turn it to look towards the left palm. Hold it for the count of five. One. Breath running naturally. Two. Three. Four. Five. With the inhalation side, exhalation on the side, hands just away, body breathing naturally. For the count of five, one, two, three. Four, five, inhalation center. Exhale, hands back. Just take the muscle a bit. One repetition with a slight change. Come ahead. And with the three fingers, grab the right palm, grab the left toe. Then left hand backward, turn neck to look back. And then twist the spine, back straight, and wait for the count of ten. One. Two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, come to the center. Change the hand, right palm on the ground by the side of the right leg, and with the three fingers of the left palm, grab the right toe. Then turn it and look back, and right hand also towards the back. Try to keep trunk straight as much convenient. 
for the rotation. Okay, it was the right palm. Let's score the pin. Out of ten. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. And head hand back. Take left hand towards the back. Both hands at the back. Legs loose at ease. The last position. Back, stand up. Join arm, get the arm comfort between the legs, body loose and comfortable. Take a breath in, sail, get knees down, hip down, make the chair pose, and hands stretch away. Count of five. One, two, three, four, five. With inhalation, come up. Exhale, hand by the side of the body. Body let it loose. Now, sit down. <laughs> right in. Hold it. Exhale. More exhalation. Then inhale and exhale. Five times deep breath. Uh, we have this towards the closer of the session. Hope all of you are fine. We'll end with a small prayer. Oh, Sarina, Sarina, Olaktu. Sahelium Karvahari Tejasvina Vadhi Namastu Avid Vishavahari Om Shanti Shanti, Shanti.
Thank you so much. Have a nice day. For any queries or any difficulty or advices, you can write down to the Nepal Online School Yoga Class Talks. Thanks. We are closing. Thank you. Thank you.